Hello, hello everyone, what's up? It's me here, Bounty Hunter Bricks, and today I am here with a brand new Clone Army Customs Haul. Um, it's been quite a while since I've uh, gotten anything from Clone Army Customs, so this is a really exciting uh, package we have here, especially because I've been waiting eagerly for about a week and a half now, I think. It got a little delayed with the whole present day weekend and all that, so... This is exciting. Um, I've never actually had Clone Customs come in a box before. This is kind of odd. Usually it's kind of those little yellow envelopes, but hey, I guess now that Clone Customs is becoming a bigger company, they just want to do it in boxes and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. Um, it's been uh, maybe definitely not a year, but maybe a, almost a year, like eight or so months since I've made an order. So um, this is really exciting to have here and can't wait to try to get more of these to show off on the channel and uh with that let's get right into this i guess all right so we're just going to cut right into this here unfortunately i do not have my knife today so no uh bounties pro knife tips or anything you know unfortunately um it has to happen sometimes but uh it's all right you know and then there we go i hope there isn't any more tape i don't think so no okay and there we go okay that is awesome so we're gonna I guess we'll just take this stuff out here, and then we'll, um... Oh, that's actually surprising. Hmm. Uh, I did not know that. Apparently, they stopped packaging these now. Um, I thought usually they would add all that, like, bubble wrap and all around it, but I guess now that they're doing it in boxes, they don't have to, so... Um, we're just gonna put those stuff to the side. You probably saw there's a figure there. We do indeed have a figure, and, um... I'll be honest, I forgot what I even ordered. It was about a week and a half ago, so, um... I'm just gonna check this paper here and uh see i have everything here okay so i took a look at the receipt and it looks like everything is here however i'm eager to look at something um because look something looked a little off i don't know but we'll just kind of see on video here um let's see i'll take a look at this first i kind of want to keep it a secret but obviously you guys probably already saw it already so we're gonna start with this and we have a helmet so here we have the arc trooper loco helmet and man this looks great so this is the um realistic version i actually had the regular ap2 their version or whatever it's called um this is definitely awesome to have in the army now so i can place that later on and then i'm gonna put that to the side right there and then that was here's the last little um side thing i bought per se uh, this is just a purple detail visor, so looking pretty good. No print errors this time, which is great because um, last time I had a print error on a yellow one. Um, I didn't. I don't even think I did a haul video for that one, so that's probably why it's been so long. Um, we'll do the clock next. Like I said, this is this is where I think there's a slight error. Um, looks like all my stuff is here. It's just kind of odd. Um, there we go. And, yep, so we have a black camera with a purple trim along with a, I think it's just a regular commander pauldron, so I don't know. Um, right here we have, if I can pull them apart, oh my gosh, um, a regular tan camera here. This is going to be used for some 187 troopers. We'll kind of look at those later. And then we have a gray camera. I'll show you what this is for in a little bit here. And then here's where I thought this is kind of odd here. Um, I did not order these. <laughs> um, yeah, I was a little confused by this. I wonder if, I don't know if these are just freebies or if something happened and, you know, they accidentally messed up the orders with somebody else's, which I feel bad for that other person if this is somebody else's or it could just be freebies, you know. Who knows? Um, but I don't think I, I don't remember Clonery Customs doing that. So I may even check out the Clonery Customs Discord and see what's going on there. You know, um, we'll fold those all up in a second here. I'll even bring out a base plate and all that. And then finally, oh yeah, we have a RP two, uh, realistic, one eighty seventh trooper over here, and I'll get that right out. Yeah. So this is actually my third Clonery Customs figure. Oh my gosh, wow. That is awesome. I'm just going to fix those hands. Um, wow, okay. That is incredible, man. Wow. Um, that looks 
awesome. And then obviously that wraparound printing on all CAC minifigures. And then we got just that regular black head. And then I did decide to get a minigun because um, I wanted one for a while. And then, okay, so it's actually like, oh, it's multiple parts. Okay, that's, that's interesting. I, I didn't even know some of this stuff. Um, yeah, that's pretty interesting. Kind of cool. Um, definitely can't wait to try to save it. Oh, I see. So if you wanted to change the orientation, so like I want to do right handed or something. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Something like that, maybe. So yeah, that's pretty neat. Um, I can't wait to go look at that. So, uh, let's bring the base plate in here and then we'll take an even closer look at this stuff. Okay. So I decided to just or assemble the figure off camera because I didn't want to feel rushed and accidentally mess up the cloth. However, I am going to add the visor on camera here. And, oh, man, that looks awesome. Awesome here. And, yeah. There we go. So, we have a 187th Commander here. Wow, this looks incredible. Um, Yeah, this is awesome to have in the army now. So, something I did notice as well. Um, I think CAC did update their camas because... Um, before they were kind of uneven to an extent, um, on this side or one of these sides, I think it was this one, it would be a little bit short and then it would be much longer. So I think they fixed that when they switched over to the, um, the laser cutting method and uh, you can even like kind of see there's a little bit of burn marks, but, um, not even a complaint even, I don't even care. It's not even noticeable at all, but, um. Yeah, great to have that in the army. It's a great figure there. And then we also got that mini gun. And actually, we'll try to make him hold it. Because I said, well, why not? We'll uh, treat ourselves here. And there we go. Never actually dealt with one of these before. So I'm hoping this is correct. There we go. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's right. Man, that looks awesome with him. Yeah, so comment down below even. Um what this guy's name should be. I think the options are going to be Commander Crow or Commander Cobra. I, I don't know. I just feel this would be an awesome Commander um, Cobra or Crow kind of guy. Just, I don't know. <laughs> uh, and anyways, we're just going to put him in the back here. We do have some figures we're going to kind of add on to here. So we have the Arc Trooper and we have our 187th along with our Airborne. Um, a while back, I ordered those gray, light gray camas, but that didn't go well. I really wanted the um, dark gray, rather, because it just does not do it justice. And we're going to put that on. Oh, my gosh. Wow. That looks incredible. And then, unfortunately, I don't have a dark gray antenna on me. So we're, this green one is going to do. Got to be careful because recently um, it's been kind of stiff with the helmets lately yeah we'll do that and that looks great too wow okay um unfortunately the camera is not doing it justice today nope it is not it's all right um so it looks great there and then we have our 187 through ground i guess um yeah we can assemble these off camera too just so you don't have to sit here while you know i have to figure it out so okay so after a good five minutes of pretty pathetic trying to try to get these camas on we finally got them here um i forgot to even mention why i needed these camas right here um it's actually because i bought a third one of the republic fighter tanks so i'm gonna have quite a uh 187th army here so i kind of need the commander you know um just to round it all off so i'm pretty happy with this haul overall especially with the you know extra cloths right um i even sent a message to uh, Tyler on Twi on Discord, I'm sorry, um, just to make sure, and he said it was all right, you know, I guess it was just a little mix-up, um, so no worries there, obviously, sometimes they just mess up a little bit, and that's all right for such a small company, the fact that they even ship all this stuff out and make everything, so, uh, this, that's gonna be it for the haul, I guess, um, let me guys, or let me know in the comments down below what you think, and, um, uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Later.